What's up, y'all? It's Mark from Resistance Quest. And I figured I'd start this video off by just demonstrating just how upset I get about my uneven lower back, which uh, you'll see very shortly what I'm talking about a little bit. As you can see here, the left side of my uh, mid-lower back is uh, bigger than the right side and not in any purely cosmetic way. You can kind of see there, the left side there is a little thicker. The right side is a little lagging. And this affects my ability to stand up uh, straight without uh, getting some kind of back strain or, you know, my back ending up too tight uh, the next day. So this is what I've been doing, one of the things I've been doing to address this. It's a one-legged deadlift, obviously. I'm pushing back my right leg and holding the dumbbell in my left hand. And what I'm trying to do is keep my leg really far back there so that my glute is clenched and it really recruits the erector on that side, which is one of the areas I'm trying to target. Here you can see me, I'm trying to, I'm trying to uh, inhibit the tight side of my lower back. That would be the, as I said, left side. The left side is really tight and thick because of drumming. Maintaining an upright posture while rock and roll drumming just seems to have created a prolonged isometric contraction of the muscle, which has led to, you know, that side getting too big and taking all of the work onto itself whenever I'm trying to stand upright or sit upright when I'm walking around, if I'm standing for a prolonged period. So like I said, here I'm trying to self-myofascial release the left erector. And here I'm going to hit the right one a little bit too, because that one seems to get tense also. Um, so I just wanted to show you what I've been doing to help my back. And uh, I hope you got something out of this video. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the next video.